Hello, one and all! Welcome back to Let's Play the Ultimate Doom! When we last left off, we were still on this level, the Mount Erebus level! And we were getting ready to do something very, very stupid. How stupid? Very stupid. If you thought imps were the extent of what we unleashed, you're quite wrong. Lots of lost souls. You are now crazily flying throughout the map and have already hit me twice. I am not in the proper Duke mindset right now, clearly. I want to grab that and that for a little bit of armor. Grab that. Excellent. There is an invulnerability spear. We will be using that later, I think. Not yet, but soon. Ah! There's one of the ones that got lost. Right. Have to remember now where we haven't been officially in this level. Moving to here causes that platform to sink. I don't know why I decided moving there to show you that was a good idea. But I did it anyways. I do what I want. Can't really get a good hit on these guys. Do I have a chainsaw? I do. Best way to deal with that situation. I don't remember where these lead. Ah, this one leads over here. Maybe the other one leads to that wonderful plasma guy. Was that the same one? Did I use the same teleporter? Or did I lead to the same spot? Nope. There we are. Wonderful. That was one of the things I wanted to get before I exited this level. Which opens another monster closet. As we lovingly call them. Why did I just stand there? I don't know. Demons take a lot of punishment, and I just walk on the lava. It's not a big deal. We are saving that soul sphere for when we leave, and I'm sure I can scrounge enough stim packs to try to get to 100 before that point. So we'll have plenty of health. That's not an issue. Ooh, there's an auto map in that one over there. We've been through here, which then closes and locks you in. Not a bad problem. Not a big deal. Considering we've already been through here quite extensively. Leads over here, which gives us another stim pack. And allows us to leave through the secret exit if we wanted to. That leads back to there. Where was that one that led to the radioactive suit and the auto map? There it is. <sighs> Getting that might really help us. I mean, we've got plenty. This one hasn't opened yet. Nope, it has, which leads to a soul sphere. Ah, uh, you know what? I actually want that, because we have another one. We're going to pick up that radioactive suit, and we're going to go through here now. Which leads to the exit, which is not actually what I wanted to do. I, I stepped in that like an idiot. My bad. My bad. I'll tell you what we'll do now, though. Since, we, since we've done that. Where is one of the other suits? Order the invulnerability spear. That'll work, too. Let's actually grab that. Say to hell with all those guys. Go over here, grab that, and let's just be going. We haven't been to that center area yet, I don't think, nor do we need to. I told you I wanted to show off the rest of what this level had to offer, and I have you. And I have, I mean. Oh, shoot. 
That was embarrassing. But we're going to try again as many times as we want. And we should be careful because there are still going to be loft souls rummaging around the place. Let's save as save 18. No, no, no. We want something much bigger. Not that big. Not that big. We want to try this again. Wonderful. Whoa. Close. A secret is revealed. Mount Erebus is finished. We have over 100% health and over 100% armor. And we enter the Warrens. Welcome to the secret level of this episode. It's not a fun one. Almost immediately you'll notice... Well boy, this place looks familiar, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Remember when we were here earlier? Killing things with our pistol, then we opened up a door and saw a cack and even? What do you think is going to be behind the door this time? Do you think it's going to be some cack and evens? Guess what? It's some cack and evens. You might be thinking to yourself, haven't we been through this? Well, if you're talking specifically about this area, yes, we have. It's copy paste. What makes this secret level so interesting is it takes the idea of a level we've already been through and radically changes it. How radically? You'll see soon enough. Let's get through here. Ow. At least I didn't manage to get hit twice. You can run this way to get that if you needed to. We'll show them what it's like. Which leads over here, which leads down here. It means you can go through there again. You could also go around there, but I don't remember why you'd want to. This area was previously full of pinkies, and it still is. But this time, we have a chainsaw, which is the ideal weapon for extremely close quarter pinky combo. Personally, I've been speaking out in the butt. I can't remember what makes this level different from the secret level, but I do remember that it does. There is one episode, there's one level that is actually mirrored. That's the whole point of it. It's not this one, though. It gets different somewhere, I'm sure. Or does it? I'm actually slightly concerned that this might be a glitch. Because that was the same. There we are! Okay, good, good, goody, goody. <laughs> it's not a bug. It's just a cyber demon, no big deal. Uh, we are not fighting a cyber demon with rockets, we're not crazy. What we'll do is pick them all up and have Adam get the plasma gun. Because the level is likely to end as soon as he dies. We are nearly out of plasma ammo. We are out of plasma ammo. Blue key card. Which we failed to pick up. Don't you shoot us, you big jerk. If I can buy my rocket launcher, we will actually resort to using rockets now. Got him! Let's grab these quickly. Grab the blue key card. Do we want to pick up that soul sphere? Oh, hello, Kakademons! I'm glad the level changed at least. We now have 97 rockets. The next time we really want to use rockets against something, we have rockets to use. I'd rather lure you to the door. I completely forgotten how this secret level works. I'm glad something about it at least changes. Um, let's go ahead and, and grab both these things. You know what? We'll grab this too.
You know, while we have the invulnerability, we should probably try to go figure out what's across that little gap. Wouldn't that be interesting to see what's how that's changed during the secret level? I'll tell you what. Nope. The vulnerability is basically done. Oh! But they give you one of these, because they do expect you to actually go that way. I missed there. That could have been done more elegantly. Am I out of shock ammo? No, it just switched. Let us use rockets. Because they're currently something we are very much full of. Unfortunately, when this radiation suit let, runs out, we're going to be in a spot of bother. But we can use that vulnerability orb. Let's not use the rockets in this kind of close quarters combat. Let's actually use the rockets again, because now we're fighting Gagnons. Plasma gun. Restore some of the plasma ammo that we've lost. And now they want us to go that way. Just as our suit loses its last little bit of juice. We're going to have to use that invulnerability orb, but we're going to have to make good use out of it here. Alright, let's run. Let's run like our butt is on fire, because if we don't make it through that field before this ends, it will be. Wonderful. Are we supposed to leave this way? Yes, we are. Are we still invulnerable? Well, we were very briefly. We're going to lose most of our extra health here. Okay, that could have gone worse. The problem with being in green vision is I can't see a damn thing. There's that guy. Let's use rockets on him, because we have plenty. As I miss with most of them. Fire the extra one there, just because we could. Ah! Now there's tons of them. Again, we still have over 50 rockets. Start using them a little bit more sparingly here. Okay, goody. We'll pick up that one. We nearly ran out of the charge that we did have. Do we have an auto map? Whoop. Don't know. Or, no, we don't is what I mean, but. Just looking to see if there's anything in these alcoves, you know? Whoops. I accidentally hit caps lock, which disabled our run. I was going very, very, very slow. We can come back out that way. Which leads to here. I want to hit this one. And that is the way out. The warrants was finished. We did not find any secrets. Welcome to the Gate to Limbo. And already we are being besieged. The good news is, now that we've been through the secret level, we don't have to worry about fighting another one. For once, the exit to the last level and the entrance to the new one actually has something in it. Was it a good thing to find all those cacodemons? For a backpack? Yes. We need to start reaccumulating all that plasma ammo we used on that cyber demon. Because having that is very important. We're making quite a bit of progress in this video. There are pinky demons coming from all directions. That's fine. 
I like when they just take two shots. That one's gonna take more. Well, in here we have two blue doors. So at least we can count that area as taken care of. Let's not run across that field until we have to. In here, there's something behind that pillar, obviously. Some shotgun ammo I don't currently need. I'm starting to remember this level now. If you think that was a good thing, it was not. I'd rather deal with those lost souls. Alright, let's switch to the shotgun. Watch our six here. They're still floating around. There is a 200% armor upgrade. Which we will gladly claim. One of them managed to wander all the way over there. There's a door there. An alcove in here. Did I say a door? I meant a butt. There's a butt there. Let's go ahead and we'll run across there. We have a teleporter. Let's find out what the button does. Probably nothing good. Can't be quite sure. Cause I don't see anything that happened. He had the blue key card. There's a button over here now. <coughs> and this area is now open. Revealing a butt ton of cacodemons. We're going to kill a butt ton of cacodemons. One shotgun blast at a time. We don't currently have the means to fire two shotgun rounds at a time. And we will not for the course of this game. Whoa! 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 Calm down there, guys. We're not going to go grab that. There's no good sense to it. We could go find out what's over there. Nothing left in there that we know of. Nothing over there that we know of. Let's figure out where this teleporter leads. He said, not really wanting to know what teleporter actually led. Oh. It is a fake teleporter. It lies. It's actually just a piece of red floor. Don't want to know where that leads. We'll just lose too much health. Back here is nothing new, but we can go open those blue doors now, starting with the way backwards. This area looks like it's going to have something dramatic in it. Red door, which I assume to be the exit. And a hall leading to a big guy. Oh, I was hoping it would hit the ceiling and crush him. Looking at our ammo counts here, we can afford just to spend some rocket ammo on this guy. I mean, chunk of ammo. Takes a while, but we don't have half plasma yet. And I'd rather save the rockets for when we're fighting a bigger crowd. Boot that down again. We can step over here. We have now opened the way to the red door. Which we don't have, of course. I believe that's the exit. Probably wrong. Oh dear. 
I don't like the look of this at all. I'm gonna step back before it closes on me. And let me come back, folks. Going through that area. I'll see you all later. This is Wabadaku signing off. Take care and bye bye.